This is a tale about heroes, real heroes. But in this case, it's not so clear to the public who the hero is, since the villains are people who are supposed to be serving our democracies. The protagonists, our heroes, are astonishing everyday people. The antagonist is the corrupted family court system, who should be humbly protecting us, but they are not. Kidnapped Hearts is a shocking and eye-opening documentary that exposes you to the darkest side of the corrupted family court system in USA and other Anglo-Saxon countries. If you have never been involved in this life-destroying court system, you will be very shocked to see that it's one of the most corrupted, dangerous and repugnant industries in the world right along the side of the drug cartels, using children and family members as a weapon and scaring away even allegedly killing individuals, brave righteous people who dare to denounce and fight against the corrupted family courts. We know that it's hard to imagine all this, but we're not making this up. Please watch and see it for yourselves. The court officials target helpless, clueless, preferably wealthy parents to take, legally steal and kidnap their children, blackmail millions of dollars out of them, prolonging and complicating the court processes so the lawyers and other family court members are able to squeeze all the money and credit out of their clients. Court officials in general, bar association members, lawyers, judges, psychologists, counselors, aides and so on who run the family courts are mostly awful criminals running a very successful criminal enterprise supported by this greedy monster and faulty but powerful judicial system which creates 50 billion dollars profit per year in USA alone. Victimized families in countries like UK, Australia, Canada and USA are the ones suffering the most from this greedy monster who is devouring, mistreating and torturing us and our children from within. A judicial system where the executioners bear no consequences since the English system that was established those countries in the time they were colonized is obsolete and the court officials, especially the judges, are like kings in their realms, doing whatever is best for them and not for the common good or falsely claimed best interest of the child. Many, too many associations and individuals have come forward accusing the family court system of obsolete, unsupervised, cruel, misleading, legally unjust, harassing, satanic, pedophilic conduct and of human trafficking. They have suffered tragic consequences, paying for their courage with their own lives, as you're going to see in this surprising documentary that honors those heroes, some of whom have even been killed after exposing the family court corruption. You will be shocked to see that the bright sunny side of this obsolete judicial system does not exist anymore since the revisions and reforms that have been done to the family court system have been in detriment of the public and for the benefit of the people who are supposed to be helping the families and their children. A reform needs to be made urgently and the struggle to do it has been brutal. More institutions, foundations and individuals should come together every day to support the men, women, loving parents and hopeless children who are trapped by this injustice system in order to fight this evil monster and keep our future and present safe as a humankind. Kidnapped Hearts shows the suffering of these families through the eyes of various brave individuals that have been deeply affected by this precarious system and the courageous people who raised their voices against it, taking the risk of being forever silenced. The profit-driven family courts in the USA care about one thing and one thing only, the cash, and not about the well-being of the humankind. The $50 billion family court system is tearing our families apart from within and as you will see in Kidnapped Hearts, they have been getting legally away with it all this time, hurting whoever they need to hurt, even helpless children. <laughs>